Yeah, I know. They forced this. This is a oh. It's on. So, I would like to welcome everybody to the Senior Christmas Chapel of 2018-2019 school year. Can I get a round of applause, please? Thank you. Thank you. We're going to start the morning off with a little game show. Um, it's going to be pretty interesting, pretty competitive, so are we ready? And I would like to welcome your host... Benjamin Graham to the stage. All right, all right. We're playing class feud today. We got two teams with us. We got the underclassmen. Yeah. And then we have the upperclassmen. It's a lot of enthusiasm out there. I love it. All right, can we have the board up, please? There we are. All right, I'm going to need the first two people up from the chairs and up to the table. Now, the rules of the game are simple. You put your hands behind your back, put one hand on the table. There we are. And once I announce the question, you have the time to slam down on the buzzer, and then you have five seconds to answer the question. Now, there's going to be the first category. Get that first category up. <laughs> Avi's pretty slow today. I'm sorry, guys, but it's just, it's just what happens. The first category is... Oh, there we go. First category is going to be a book of the Bible that references Jesus' birth. All right, on your marks, get set, and go. So, on to five seconds, what's the first in the category? Is it Luke? It is. Now, pick up your mic. Now you and your team have the first chance. We're going to go around on your team, and we're going to let them answer the rest. And if you get three wrong, they have a chance to steal. But if they get that one wrong, you win the category. All right. Cedar Smith, what do you think is any of the books of the Bible that references Jesus' birth? Can I get Matthew on the board? All right. All right, Trent. Book of the Bible that references Jesus' birth. Mark. Can Mark on the board? All right. Kurt. Isaiah. Isaiah. Can I get Isaiah on the board? Oh, my goodness. Back to Olivia. Olivia. John. John. Can I get John on the board? Oh. You have two more chances. Two more chances. Back to you, Cedar. First John. First John. Can I get first John? Oh. You got one more chance. And if you get this wrong, they can steal. Samuel. <laughs> Samuel. Ah, uh, let's see if the underclassmen can steal it. All right. Savan, I think you're on. <laughs> Books of the Bible that references Jesus' birth. <laughs> There's two answers up there. Genesis. All right, you guys win that category. All right, I'm going to need Savan and I'm going to need Cedar up here. One hand. I'm trying to hit the buzzer. All right. Name a popular Christmas movie, second category. Ready? Set, go. We'll, re we'll redo that one because then it's got. All right, set, so go. All right, Cedar. A Christmas 
A Christmas story. All right. Back to your table, and they can answer the category. Trent. A popular Christmas. Oh, wait, what? Oh, you got a try? You got a higher one? Okay, higher one. Any higher ones? Elf. Oh, is it? Is it? It's Elf. All right, now I'm over here. All right. Home Alone. Top points. All right. I'm going to let them talk of it. I'm going to let them talk of it. You ready? The Grinch. The Grinch. The Grinch. Oh, there was one wrong there. Keep going, keep going. You, got, you guys got two more chances. The Polar Express. The Polar Express. Oh, one more chance. You have one more chance. Santa Claus movie. Santa Claus movie. Ah, we're back over here. You guys can steal. You need at least one answer to steal it. Charlie Brown Christmas. Charlie Brown Christmas. Ah, and you guys win that category. You guys win that category. That's good. All right. What? They won. They won. They won. The ones that they didn't get. Ah. Next category. People in the third chair, come on up. All right. Third category. A holiday greeting. Give a holiday greeting. I didn't say go, Trent. All right. Give a holiday greeting. Go. Oh, holiday greeting. Give me a holiday greeting. Can I get Merry Christmas? Oh. Oh. All right. I think you have a chance to steal. Can you get the top answer? Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Oh, my goodness. Now, you guys only have to answer two. There's only two answers up there. A holiday greeting. Hanukkah. Happy Hanukkah in a Christmas game show. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. All right. There's one more on the board. One more on the board. Season's greetings. Season's greetings. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Look at all the points. All right, I'm going to need the fourth person. And this category happens to be name a popular Billboard Christmas song. Go. Kurt, popular Christmas song. All I want for Christmas is you. All I want for Christmas is you. Oh, my goodness. All right. All I want for Christmas is you. All right. You have four more on the board. Okay, um, White Christmas. White Christmas. Ah. Oh. Jingle Bell Rock. Jingle Bell Rock. There it is. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Oh, no. All right, one more. A couple more. There's a couple more on the board. Jingle bells. Jingle bells. All right, all right. You guys have a chance to steal. If you get two, if you get number two, you guys can keep going. Baby, it's cold outside. Baby, it's cold outside. Oh, no. And that's the end of the game. Your upperclassmen win. And thank you for playing Class Feud. Have a good day.
Oh, okay, all right. Thanks, guys, for playing. That was great. Um, so now, while we're transitioning, we have a skit, actually, right after this kind of thing. So while we're transitioning, we're going to have some Christmas carols being sung, led by Alexa Kennel and a select group of the seniors. And it's going to sound amazing. So go ahead and take it away. in the hymnal. I'll give you a few seconds to get that out. Um, and we're going to sing verses 1 and 3. Oh, come all you faithful, and we'll be singing verses 1 and 2 for this. 
Angelic. Thank you, guys. Um, so now, um, I would like to introduce, we have members of a skit actually written and directed by our very own I, Barry, up here in the front row. Um, these guys are comic geniuses, so let's, let's see how this goes. Let's go, guys. Is this on? So yeah, basically I told that guy to stick his tinsel where the sun doesn't. Oh, hey guys, I didn't see you there. So, it's Christmas time, and you're probably wondering, where are all my decorations? Well, the answer is a pretty simple one. I hate Christmas, and everything to do with it. Yeah, that's it. I hate Christmas carols, tinsel, decorating the Christmas tree, and I especially hate Santa Claus. Like. What's that creep's deal? He sneaks into your house at night, takes your food, spies on little children, and keeps track of your every move. To me, I'm a little creeped out. And that's why every Christmas I strengthen my home security and turn on my cameras, but somehow, oh, that guy must be a genius because somehow he always gets in. I've never caught him or seen him, but I know he comes in. I see presents under my mantle every Christmas morning and I live alone. Hello? We wish you a Merry Christmas. Ah! No! Get out! Out of my house! I hate it! Leave my house! Shut up! What's the deal? Didn't didn't you know we'd be coming? I told you we'd be coming. You are part of the Christmas choir? <laughs> Sorry, whenever I hear the word Christmas, I just tune everything you're about to say out. You didn't know I was part of the Christmas choir, and I am part of the Christmas choir. And I'm also host of Class Feud weekdays at 8.30. That's not important right now. Other than that, how could you hate Christmas? I love Christmas, because you know why? It's the most wonderful time. If you stop singing right now, I'll let you stay in my house. You can't kick me out. I'm your brother. Ha, no brother of mine sings in the Christmas choir. Well, maybe you'll have to deal with it because I enjoy Christmas. What? Are you senile? <laughs> Enough of that. I must go because the choir's probably waiting for me out there. You know what? You probably need your bells jingled because you need more Christmas spirit. I will leave the country before I ever get any ounce of Christmas spirit. Goodbye. Bye. Brother, my bells jingled. 
is that how pro-Christmas people talk? I'd be like, what does that even mean? You see what I mean? They speak a different language than I, and they dress different. They support something so criminal as stalking. I mean, what do you think the colors green and red mean? Broccoli and blood? I wouldn't put it past them. <sighs> well, it's been a long day. I guess I'll just go to bed. Eat this, Santa! Wait, 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 wait! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, wait, wait, it's me, it's me, it's your brother! What?! It's been me all these years putting presents under the tree. But, I, d but, but where's Santa?! What are you talking about? It's, Santa doesn't exist. I, what?! It, it's been me, it's been me all these years. Are you kidding me right now? Listen, it's been me giving you presents all these years. I have the key to your house, and I always assumed you enjoyed the presents. I knew if Santa were real, he'd give you a lump of coal for Christmas. So that's why me, uh, our parents, and also the Christmas choir have been giving you gifts all these years. Make you feel good. I cannot believe this. All these years, I've always, I've always thought a stranger was breaking into my house. That, that Santa Claus, but... But he's not even real? It's just been you? You're Santa? Well, okay, I'm not the real Santa, and I'm not Santa at all. I just wanted to make Christmas meaningful for you. We all did. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> Calm down there, neighbor. We just wanted to show you that even though you rudely pushed us out into the snow, and I'm pretty sure we'll have hypothermia because we haven't been inside since then, besides all that, we love our neighbors like Jesus loves us. This is his holiday, after all. We should all be rejoicing together. Now put down the broom and open your presents. See, Christmas isn't just about a random guy in a red suit. This is what we've been trying to tell you. It's about friends coming together in the spirit of Jesus' name. Huh. Well, when you put it like that, Christmas doesn't sound so bad. Say, do you think it's not too late for all of us to go to church tomorrow all together for the Christmas service? How could it be late? It's church. I mean, I just attacked all of you with the broom. Is it too late for all of us to be friends and spend the Christmas together tomorrow? Nah, we believe in second chances. Of course, we can all spend Christmas together tomorrow. Uh, how about some caroling? Well, okay, just don't expect me to sing. Don't forget your mittens. Last time, I got frostbite. That's not good. And Merry Christmas, everyone. Ha 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 ha! Thanks, guys. Can we, can we get another round of applause for that, please? Thank you. All right, so kind of in closing, can, can you just bow your heads with me? We're going to pray real quick. <laughs> Dear God, thank you for this season where we can spend time with friends and family and celebrate the birth of your son, Jesus. Thank you for sending your son to us so he could pay the ransom for our sins and allow us to live freely. Thank you that we were able to attend a school like Doc, where we are free to worship you and where we are truly prepared to thrive in the future. <laughs> Thank you that we are able to gather here as a school and have a fun time celebrating the season. In your name we pray, amen. Yeah, and so the senior class, as kind of like a little blessing to everybody as we leave this space, um, would I like, can you guys stand up and grab, we have some candles for you that your advisors would give you, and exit to the aisles, the sent, outside aisles. What? Seniors, yes, the seniors. Just the seniors, just the seniors, yes. And uh, we're going to sing Silent Night real quick. Huh? Yeah.
Seth, could you dim the lights for me? Thanks, buddy. Yeah. Thanks for coming, guys. That was great. Yeah, anyone who participated in the game show, you can stay after for me. And uh, classes begin in five minutes. Thanks, guys.